We are in the ruins. A lot of things appear to be ruined. These ruins for one. Fana's, or the girl's relationship with Dylok. Ruined by Fana, actually. Let's try to take out Mr. Zombie Guy here before we go down the stairs. They can't really do that much to us anymore. They're not much of a threat, unless this is a uh, different one. Uh, this may be the, uh, this may be the uh, different palace swap of him. But the enemies here are not as threatening as they were in the other ruins. The other ruins we just kind of had to run through and hope we didn't get killed. Oh, Lucid Beam, yeah, that's a pretty terrible spell, but... All things considered, it could be a lot worse. See, only 19 damage by a level 3 Lucid Beam. These guys are kind of pathetic. We can actually sometimes hit the Tomato Men around here as well. Uh, you can uh, keep quit picking on me anytime soon. Hey, you can pick on me, but the Sprite can't take it. You leave him alone. And we're going to take some uh, side routes here first because you get some orbs this way. These are some very easy orbs to miss if you're just trying to blow through and make it out without getting scathed. Oh, the imps. You guys, I hate you. So we're going to skip you for now. Before I get fire bouquet, thanks a lot, guys. Thanks a lot, dickheads, for concentrating on and get the... Get out of the way of the door. Jeez. See, those imps can be really annoying, and the grim ones later on, even more so. But if you just keep coming around here, you'll eventually make it out onto the balcony. If my guys will come anytime soon. They are in serious attack mode right now. And you come out to the balcony, and this one is a uh, Bose Orb, I think. Yeah, that one's not so great, but the other one is a Spear Orb, so yes to that. So be sure to make your way around. Of course, I'm not going to use the Bose Orb in any way, but I just wanted to come around and show you where it is, because it is, if you're after all that kind of stuff, it's essential to get you. Need to, you need to know where it is. And my guys are getting their butts kicked. Holy crap. Especially me, I'm taking it the worst. Maybe we can take out these guys in this room. Maybe the imp isn't so big and bad when he's uh, sitting there on the floor. These are Grave Bats. They are the uh, more powerful pallet swap of the Blats from Guy's Navel. That was a pretty easy room right there, but we're gonna, not going to mess with the next room because there's Blue Drops and LA Funks in here. Wow, you actually got hit by him, Sprite. That is somewhat amazing. See, we can hit the Tomato Men now with the sword. It doesn't do a whole lot of damage, but it will keep him from uh, spawning... It'll keep him from spawning other guys. Holy crap. Yeah, those are ghouls. Here's our spear orb. Hooray! We'll be able to forge that at the uh, end when we get back into town. Oh, I love being able to take out the tomato man. I think they give chocolate when you uh, when they do a treasure chest. Oh, thank you for going directly to the door. Thank you so much for that. Oh, right. Some people reached level 30. Most excellent. It's not too far for the Sprite. Sprite, get it together. That is really stupid and really infuriating. Oh god, Exploder, that's gonna hurt. Well, I'm glad Sulfi reached level 30, but I am sitting here taking Exploder damage. Wonderful, wonderful. Let's get out of here. We've already uh, wasted a fair bit of time, actually. I am not so certain that you'll get orbs if you go through these uh, bottom level doors, but we may want to check anyhow. Let's go through here and see what they reveal. Nope, these are just dead end rooms. They may have been meant for something when this was a CD game, but they are totally empty as of this point. So let's just go through the main double doors here. And from here on, it's uh, not that bad. It's a fairly linear, fairly linear set of ruins from this point onward. Is there a wizard eye or a, that eye spy guy making you guys around here? Yeah, there he is. I could have gotten moogled. I need to be more careful. Well, I'll take care of this guy so he can't make any more of those guys. Not that he could at this point anyway. There's the maximum three enemy sprites on the screen. Oh, good. I didn't get loose and beat this time. See, that did like nothing to her. Her tiger bikini has way more defense than mine in the sprites tiger suits do we have like 52 defense and the tiger bikini gives her like 64 which don't ask me how that works but it's pretty awesome the girl if it comes down to it, it comes down to brass tacks the girl can take a lot of damage that's a very creepy flute in the background of that song and a bunch of different drops 
we may want to concentrate on green and red here. Well, I mean blue and red. I didn't want to concentrate on green. I wanted to save him for last if at all possible. But if we can keep these guys cornered, then they won't reproduce anytime soon. So, it looks like if we're going to get anything done to us, we are going to get in goal. Nope, but that's not happening today. Boy, we are just making it. Megan is plugging all through. Oh, cool ambush. I don't think so. All right, and now we have Robin Foot. See, easy opponents around here, actually. The only real pain in the butts are the uh, imps, and if you don't have the right armor, the uh, I think we want to go down this way to the far end of the hall. That middle door is just a dead end if memory serves. Hello, guys. Let's see if we can keep the blue drops. Nope, the green drop is advancing. And he is going to die. <laughs> Nope, nope, now we got three on the screen. I just want to get out of here now. Hopefully they didn't get frosty somewhere in there. <laughs> I've never known why they do this little rainbow type thing. Let's try to kill the ghoul before he does anything super nasty. They do have really high evades sometimes, though. Oh, and I got sped down. That's awesome. What an opening for the imp to cast Exploder. And he can engulf you with that little fire breath that he does there, so you need to be super careful of that. Do I take the hit here? No, actually. Excellent. Take care of him, guys. See? There you go. Sprite just stood there and took it. Now, look what happened. But yes, the imps can be very nasty, especially at this point. They won't be such a threat later on. But the grim ones, they're like a blue palette swap of them. and ugh. Oh, God, I hate them. And it will be your downfall, Robin Foot. Yes, ha ha ha. Okay, we got spikes up here. We need to tear these spikes down. We need to find a switch. So that these spikes will come down. And we need to remember to come back up to this room because I believe there's a... Uh, I do believe there's a... Quit curing them, jeez. There's a swords orb or something behind the door. Some kind of awesome orb is behind the door there. But yeah, these ruins move a lot more slowly because you can fight more of the enemies. You stand a better chance against this particular set of opponents. And so, you stop and fight them more. We don't want to go down into that door just yet, I don't think. Wow, that's pretty amazing. One hit whack on him. Okay, no, we do need to go down to that little door then. Make our way around the hall. Don't run into him. You might get moogled. That would be dumb. Let's just get around these guys. We do not want anything to do with the funk mob. Why don't you quit teleporting out of my way, you little imp? Sprite, you're stupid. Somebody breathes fire at you, you move out the way. And in one of these rooms, there's going to be a switch that tears up. There it is. I don't care if I get frosty. I want that switch. There we go. Let's get out of here. Anyway, what you want to do after you hit that switch is come back this way. And remember to go up to this left corner here. Not me, not me, not me. Oh, we could have reached the door in time, and she took it fairly hard there. If you want to come back up here, don't forget about this place. And I think this is the sword door that I was thinking of. Huzzah, it totally is. Level 5 sword coming up soon, but now we want to go down and we want to hit another switch. Let's uh, just get out of Mr. Gooey's way here. Hopefully the imp is not around. No, we are surprisingly impless for now. Now we touch this switch, and a door will appear behind us. Excellent. If you miss this door, or if you go in this door and you go on and you miss the sword door, that's not something you want to do. Remember to go back up to that corner and get that sword door, particularly since I'm the boy and I'm holding the sword. That's that's uh, super important for me. And uh, let's keep the treasure chest on the screen for now. I didn't even know it was there. I was wondering why he wasn't reforming or anything. Yes, let's concentrate all our efforts on this guy. There we go. Now we can concentrate on Grave Bat and in turn Treasure Chest. Hopefully this isn't anything terrible. Whoa! 
Whoa, I haven't seen one of these in this game in a long time. They are moderately powerful, I do believe. Wow. I had actually all but forgotten that they existed in this game. So uh, there's a little bit of experience for us, I guess. That's fairly neat. Let's keep moving. If we don't want to mess with these guys, we can just go down here, I believe. Let's make sure there's not anything up in the corner, actually, like something we can miss. Nope. No other doors. We're good to go. And now we're hitting up double on the imps. Hopefully their spells will not do... Alright, I got healed. Good thing I didn't uh, waste time with any sort of cure water earlier. No fire spells for you today, Mr. Imp. Excellent. Alright. People leveling up all over the place. Hopefully we can get to the boss by the time we're done here today. If we uh, run around, and I think we're almost there, actually. Let's take down the... He can't make any... any... Come on! I don't care that much. You guys need to learn to not stop and smell the roses sometimes. The roses don't always smell that great. Anyway, switch down there. We'll hit that, and then I think we'll be up at the uh, stage room. Which will lead us to the boss fight. A fairly easy one. Although there is kind of something a little bit messed up about it. If you guys would get on already... Oh, that'll do nothing to her. She's got great defense. Well, it actually did more to her than it did to me. Let's go up the way then. And I do believe this is where we'll once again meet up with Thanatos. Nope, there's more of this goings on and stuff. Let's get out of here while we can. I'm pretty sick of this place, to be honest with you. Wowza. Oh, right, Robin Foot. I do think the main stage is just... Oh, ho, 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 You almost got me, Weepy Eye. But here's the boss here. It's the Doom's Wall. And if you analyze it... Oops, that's her job. Where's Sylphid? If you analyze it, you'll find that uh, there's something very wrong here, actually. 1,180 HP. Everything's fine so far. Wait through it to get... But Doom's Wall fears Lumina, and that's a set of spells that we don't have yet. So, once again, we have to go with the next best thing, which is Thunderbolt. It's the only uh, light-related thing we've really got right now. Okay, it took the energy for its eye for some reason. That was a silly move. But yes, like the, uh, like the wall face, Doom's Wall will try to close in on you, and it won't get very far because it's a pretty weak boss. But if we keep going in like this on it, we'll probably need a, uh, we'll probably need a Thunderbolt, or a Fairy Walnut, I'm sorry. Sorry, I'm kind of confused, I'm all into this fighting this guy, but he won't take very long to put down, actually. There he goes, we didn't have to use the Walnut after all. Easy boss, really, you don't even need the Lumina that they say is required, even. But yeah, I think that's something that happened in the conversion from CD to cartridge when they had the fallout with Sony and Sony decided to go their own way and not make a SNES CD device. I think some boss orders kind of got mixed up. Oh, everybody's going to be leveling weapons. Great. But yeah, I think some uh, things got mixed up and there were some spells that you were supposed to get earlier that that didn't quite happen. Alright! Yay! We saved Dialog. Oh, except not quite. Ha <laughs> Not quite. Oh, snap, dog. Oh, crap. That was a good one, Dialog. I gotta give it to you. Snap! Bring her back. Bring her back. But Dialog, he's got the willpower. He's got the eye of the tiger. Alright, well, we're going to have to help her next time. There's a door back there. I think we are, uh... I don't think our magic is restored, actually. Go through the door back there. Well, we'll have to do that next time, because we're running out of time today. Yep, there's yet another boss to fight. So, uh, it's just me and the sprite for now. And we'll get a fight on next time. <laughs>